Now hello, this is Ashraf. We meet again. Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you on how to add colors onto your objects. All right. So in 3D, colors always being referred as materials. All right. So by default, the colors in Blender is it looks like gray but when we go here this area okay let's say you select this viewport shading you can see this is the actual color all right so it's white actually but in this viewport shading solid okay it looks gray but it doesn't matter it's actually when we render after this it looks the, the base color is actually white you can see here from the look dev uh, menu all right so you go okay we can uh i think you go to this look dev okay this one look dev all right so basically all right for any objects to change the colors or materials on any mesh or objects in Blender 2.8, it's hidden somewhere there. Okay, look, you look for this icon, this material icons. All right, so this is material. Okay, you click on material, and you can see that there are lots of menus. Okay, lots of parameters. Okay, there you have the surface volume and then setting we put display custom properties all right so in for the basic one we use preview all right check on the preview uh sorry the preview is just just to preview the colors okay you can turn this on and we go for the surface all right so by default this color is based on these colors here base color so uh, all right so let's say we change this base color to red so now our cube has turned into red okay but if you go to this solid view this is not appear so, so now for me i'm just yep look dev shading all right and this subsurface if we i see all right i hope you understand subsurface colors is another thing let's say this one is yellow so sorry green and if we reduce sorry the subsurface color we like mix from base color to subsurface color all right but as for now just leave it there at white zero, zero, zero. all right so metallics okay metallics for the metallics actually the mix the object looks matrix specular is you can see when you have lights over there you can see there that looks colors is that kind of reflects it's not a reflect actually it's some this white whitish color is coming from the lamp all right so subsurface sorry the specular is that if we read increase the number of specular so you see it's more whiter but if you reduce the specular so it's less specular so just leave it 0 0.4 0 0.5 uh the rest is not touch the rest yet okay so by default you can do like that okay okay so we duplicate and we change this one the base color to yellow so what happens now if we duplicate object shift d why okay 
and we change the base color to any colors the rest the original will follow okay so let's say we change to blue and after this all these cubes returns to blue so how to um, have different colors for duplicated objects it's easy you just go for you just go to edit mode you press tab and you change the base color and oh it's the same So never mind. Leave it there. Right. So now I'm going to delete this. Alright. So this one. Alright. Let's say you want to have different colors on each faces. Okay, we have eight faces here. So each of face we assign to new color okay let's say we select eight colors okay uh red green blue purple yellow white and black and another one is what color that i didn't mention yet this is brown all right so eight colors so let's say each of these sites we want to have different colors different materials okay it's easy first this in the color material so this material is white actually so you can rename to white white and then you add the second one yellow so you click on this plus sign all right and then you click on new and then you give the names yellow and then you change the base color to yellow so now we have white and yellow so we add red then we uh, change to red okay, and then we add green change to green okay and then we uh, blue base color blue so now what how many one two three four five another three This one is yellow, blue, yes, and this is black. So base color will be black. Alright. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So this one, let me get purple. Okay, base color purple all right Sorry. and last one will be what is it brown yeah we go for brown so where is brown base color I believe brown is somewhere there okay all right but this is orange somewhere there. Uh, or we it's orange all right so now to assign each of the face okay you go for you go to edit mode and then let's say you select this face to be in yellow color you select face you select color and then you go for assign button you assign the color let's say yellow you assign to this face it's assigned so then you can see now it's coming yellow and this green this side is green all right so, uh, red sorry for this green this side is blue oh that's not blue is it blue yep blue and this side is black and this side sorry it's six faces not eight i mistakenly 
from the wrong information sign so we have six faces with six different colors that is how easy you to apply colors or materials onto your object okay let's say this plane going to yeah just leave it white there all right yeah so that is the basics of applying materials or applying colors in blender all right so that's it you may apply the colors onto your objects onto your models by using these basic steps all right next i will show you on how to render image of a scene all right see you in the next video Bye-bye.